Okay, and welcome to this, the second episode of this playthrough. So, for those who don't know, we got washed up, the pirate ship, and we're chasing what appears to be an assassin who needs to get her to Havana. So yeah, let's continue on from there. Yeah, so this is one of the most common places to hide. What was what has replaced the haystack is palm tree sleeves. And that oh, was Where's he running to? It's a very good question, Edward. And the answer to that is we don't actually know who you'll find him, of course. But we'll find him by looking through this island. So there's a nice bit of chest, for that's a bit of money in the game. Always helpful considering well, we'll need everything we can really get hold of. Again more chests. For those who don't know, there is of course a hunt something to hunt around here, that is the paw pad. The HD I think is very well done and the mini map is very very useful. Something uh good old sneak speed master shot. I'll take that. I'll take this bit of chest too, and I know you probably want a bit of storyline right now. So uh let's go ahead with that. So we'll climb up this and uh see us over the next canyon. Probably get the uh the next point because that's We could work together on this. Yeah, I'm gonna go straight up with that synchronization point because this is Assassin's Creed and it's supposed to be assassination and one of the major things about assassins is the uh, trying to like figure out their opponent and the major part of that is to know your surroundings. So Let's see if I can't get up this goddamn tower this time. There we go, change a bit more of a run up. Right. Sorry uh, if I'm being really slow. But hey. Diving down and objective of course is to find Yes, that's Keep your distance! Oh, when he shot me. And now we have the free one chase. Yeah, let's kill this guy. He's already shot us. And we seem to be completely fine, you know? Just casually take a bullet. But hey, it doesn't matter. This dude is, appears to be an absolute utter git. He wants us to board a ship for him. It's impossible without right tools or equipment. So let's um take his ego down a notch, shall we? Yes. Shred of blood, completely normal, right? Senor Duncan Walpole, I accept your most generous offer and await your arrival with eagerness. If you truly possess the information we desire, we have the means to reward you handsomely. Though I do not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Suma su humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. This is Spanish, dude, basically. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. Oh. I hear gunshots. Oh, shit. Yeah. 
So this is where you'll get your uh, taste for sea travel and also your taste for stealth. Which is a hint I'm not gonna do. Um, I don't do stealth very well. It's not that I can't do it, I just blatantly choose not to. Stalking zones. They're bloody useful. Nuked. Hold it! Poor dude. Stop them! One reason I shouldn't vent your skull. Take my sugar! Take anything you like! I'll pay you! Anything you like! Better be stealthy. Better be cautious. Come on, Ben. What are you doing over there? Anyway. Let's do this quickly. Take my sugar! Take anything you like! Oh shut up. I don't want to take your sugar, I wanna take your ship. But I will take everything I like, of course. But everything I like, I mean my ship. I mean I mean your ship. Sword time. Oh, dead. Ooh, and dead. Double dead. Cinematic time. By God's grace, you saved me. A profusion of thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But, uh, here lies its poor captain, and I have no art for sailing. I can pilot her myself, not mine. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. What's your name, friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the <gasps> King, God save oh, and I must get to Havana with speed. Oh. That is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Oh, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? Yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. But, all things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? Okay, so we can reach the ship's wheel, but there's some things. I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my ship. Hardly the worst thing to happen. There's some things we need to go over first, although this is we'll do that in the next episode because I'll need to explain the maps to you. So, well, I'll read this up. Find treasure maps on explorers' cadavers. They will lead you to a specific place on an island. Dig there, and you might find money or plans to upgrade your ship. And then the controls, um, coordinates, beauty of the island, the image will help you find the spot. It can be something seen, but I don't have one, so yeah. Um, of course it's activated from this, and this is it. You can easily see the ship, the palm tree, and where you've got to go, and the directions. So, on that note, let's wrap it up here for this episode, and we'll see you on the next. Goodbye.